In this episode, I met up with a longtime friend, Margaret Kimura, who is also a renowned Hollywood makeup artist. So, how long have we known each other?、Um, oh, God, that's going to give away our age. <laughs> we were really young. <laughs> And we still are. <laughs> we are. We are. <laughs> so, about 30 years? Yeah. <gasps> oh, my goodness. It's been 30 years. You haven't changed. Look at you. You never change. I look at your Instagram, I'm like, so it doesn't change. <laughs> Vampire.、Um, I am a former Hollywood makeup artist, and I still dabble in the beauty industry as a consultant and, you know, any kind of information that, like, say, a business needs based on makeup, and especially for Asian women.、Um, but I retired on set. Probably like two years ago. But yeah, Hollywood makeup, it was my specialty. specialty yeah. yeah. Did a lot of crazy productions in Hollywood. So, have you worked with anyone famous that we would know of? Well, yes,、um, probably. <laughs>、um, I would say that my、um, probably the longest client I've had was Arnold Schwarzenegger. And of course, Andy McDowell, who's also one of my best、Beautiful. friends.、Mm. Yeah, still to this day, even though I don't do makeup anymore, we're still friends, you know. I and mean, I think we've always been great friends even before,、um, you know, I did her makeup on projects and things like that. It, it was me, it was like us, like we're family and then we do jobs together right, professionally. Right. So, For, for that, those are like the two long term, actually, many Japanese commercials. The, and I mean, I don't know、uh, if you know any of the,、um, the Nishin、uh, Cup of Noodles.、Mm. I did all the series with、oh, those.、Yeah. And the, the Vitamin V b o o y the one where he does this. And the, so I, I probably did probably like 15 commercials for Japan with him. Wow. Yeah, so that was fun. That was, yeah, he's, he's a great guy. And, you know, I'm, I'm very, very fortunate to. Not only have worked with him, but also become his friend. And, you know, and he's been such a wonderful support you know, on many levels. So, can you tell us how you got started being a makeup artist? God, it's a long story. <laughs>、um, I started really, really young. I think that、um, you know, it, it kind of was like a calling I had since I was like 12 years old. And I was really super inspired. It was kind of like Something I saw myself doing、mm -hmm. since I was a little girl. I love photography. So I think me having that connection to photography、um, opened my eyes to the fact that if you just don't take a picture, you gotta set the picture up. And I loved fashion. I used to look at all the Vogue magazines when I was a little kid. And、um, one thing led to another. I think I was very blessed. I think one of the things that when you become Uh, recognized in this, and I'm sure you know as an actress as well. You know, there's so many people that want to do it, but there's not that many that really actually make it. And so, when they do make it, it's a blessing. And in fact, I, I worked with、um, Mel Gibson once on a film with Ron Howard called、um, Ransom many, many years、oh, ago.、Yes. They put us in this one room to do his makeup, and so here was just me and Mel. And all of a sudden, I saw this girl, little girl, and then he said, Hey, little girl, what are you doing? What's your name? And she's like, Hi. And, and then she's, she's kind of like curious, and he's like, Come on in, come on in. So, so he's like, Oh, cool, what do you want to do? And she goes, I don't know yet. She goes, But I'm really interested in becoming a filmmaker.、Mm -hmm. How did you do it? You know, well,、um, tell me, what is the secret to becoming successful? And so he goes,、uh, Margaret, you answer her. <laughs> <laughs> and the only thing I could, I could think of was, you know, I guess we're lucky. You know, aside from the fact that we're hard workers、mm -hmm. and we're very dedicated and we love what we do, because that has to be there first,、yes. um, that we were able to get past that and be、mm -hmm. recognized, and that's a blessing,、mm -hmm. you know? So, you know. One of the things that I feel I always try to tell because I've had a makeup school for a long time in Hollywood, and you know, my students would come from all over the world, and 
you know, that's one of the training that I would give them is that, you know, you perfect your art, mm -hmm. you know, because art is everything that is going to propel you. It's the bloodline of, of why you're going to do this, right. you know. But success is something that if you show you're passionate and if you show that you're dedicated and hardworking, that comes through and people see that. Mm -hmm. But you got to be damn good first. You know, you can't just be like a decent or mediocre. You got to be really great. Thanks for watching my interview with Margaret. Tune in next time.